Hello guys, thank you to all my subscribers, followers, fans, friends, family, everybody else in the world who might stumble upon this video. Today, I want to show you one of the amazing benefits of living in Costa Rica that people rarely talk about. Uh, once a year, the health services and Red Cross and the municipality, the government in Costa Rica comes around to houses probably every house, but definitely up towards the mountains where people don't have access to a lot of resources or transportation or supermarkets. And they bring us these care packages, which are amazing. And for me, they always seem to come in a time of need, um, right before the holidays, which is nice. Somehow it's like they can sense in the air that people, you know, need things or, you know, are low on money or whatever it might be. So they come up and they deliver these care packages and, I haven't done this yet because I've still been trying to figure out a lot of things about Costa Rica and living here, but this is one that seems to be consistent and it's happened every year and it just happened. So I want to show you uh, what they bring. They basically just ask for your name, your ID number, your which you know as a resident, it's your DMEX number. As a foreigner, it would be your passport number. Um, but since I have residency, I have my DMEX, so I give my DMEX number and then just a signature and how many people live in the house. Now, in case I haven't said this in past videos, once a year, a doctor from the clinic in Perita also comes around on his motorcycle to the houses and checks blood pressure, heart rate, a lot of the vitals, gives any medicines or what do you call them, vaccines or anything that you want, inoculations, uh, tetanus shots, all the things like that. At your house, they will come to your house once a year, whether you can get to the hospital or not for your annual checkup, which is amazing. And I know for a fact they don't do this in the United States, and I'm quite sure they don't do this in many countries. But back to the point, today was the Red Cross and the municipality coming to deliver this package, this care package. And now I'm going to show you what was in this package. So the first thing they give you is some vegetable oil, which is you know necessary for everything that we're cooking here. Obviously it's not coconut oil or avocado oil or sesame seed oil or something super fancy and healthier, but it's free and it's a gift. So it's really nice. Now what else they give, um, this is what the package looks like, the bag. It's like a big, heavy, 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 heavy bag. And in it, we have some Volio coffee, which is great, I love coffee. We also have, and I don't usually use this, but I'll tell you what I am gonna use it for. This is um, condensed milk. I won't drink this, but we do a thing here in Costa Rica called choco bananas. And so you take a banana, dip it in some chocolate, melted chocolate, like molding chocolate, and then you roll it in condensed milk and maybe put some sprinkles on it. And it is a delicious, delicious snack and dessert. So that's what I'm gonna use this for with the blue Java bananas. And you guys will see that in a video coming very soon because the bananas are almost ready. Also, oatmeal, always necessary and I do eat this. Something I don't eat, but guests to my house do eat, tuna, cans of tuna. There's also a ranchero pasta sauce. We also have a big bag of white sugar, which I typically don't use. I usually use like a brown sugar or more natural sugar, so I may gift this to one of my neighbors or trade it for something. Something I will eat, absolutely, a bag of rice. And this is the better version, 95% quality. Um, sometimes I do 99%. Sometimes when I'm trying to save money, I buy a giant bag, like a seven, eight kilogram bag of 91%. So there's all different grades. This is right in the middle, quality-wise. Oh, I'm sorry, oh, two of those. What a bonus. So we got two of those. I also have two bags that they gave of Tio Pelon's frijoles, red beans. So I've got two bags of those. Thank you, Tio Pelon, tambien. What else do we have in here? Oh, I got some soap. Soap, soup. I've got some, uh, I guess these are like a mix, right? This is uh, cola de res. So it's like... Um, beef flavor of beef so i probably won't eat this either this will be a gift or a trade to one of my neighbors we got two of those i have a few more of those ranchero sauces so actually i don't eat a lot of pasta i eat a ton of rice and what i'll do is i'll mix this into my rice to add some flavor to it and also eggs huevos rancheros i use that for eggs sometimes 
We also have, this is good. So this is, uh, I don't know, this is tapa dulce. And this is um, made from sugar cane. It's a sugar extract, sweet extract from sugar cane. And then this you put in like a, a glass of water, just mix it up. You can use this as a sugar alternative. Uh, really sweet, really awesome. Like I said, sometimes when I don't wanna be chugging coffee all day, I'll just do you know a bottle of water and mix some of this in and it's a nice little sweet treat. More ranchero sauce. And then we're finishing up, they gave some pasta. So this is for any future guests that are coming to stay at my house. You know who you are. Um, partners, this pasta is for you because I'm not going to eat it. So anyway, that's the care pack. Oh, there's something else in here. I'm sorry. One more thing. I think this is salt. Let me just double check and be sure. Yep. So we've got some, just a bag, 500 grams, half a kilo of salt, which we use for soups and rice and everything like that. So... Thank you, Parita. Thank you, Costa Rica. Thank you, Cruz Rojo. Thank you, Vasconia. Thank you, Lucho. Thank you, Pablo. Thank you, everybody. Costa Rica is the best. If you guys didn't know it and you live here, you get free health checks at your house by the doctor once a year. They come to your house. You also get these food pack deliveries. Obviously, this is going to last a whole year. If you have a family, this might last a couple of weeks. For me living alone, all of this stuff will probably last me at least a month, maybe a month and a half. Depends on what it is. Some things I don't eat as quickly, but thank you, thank you, thank you. This is the best country in the world to live in, hands down, no question. So, extra addition, I forgot to add, I had left a bag outside that also had two rolls of toilet paper. One, two, let me get them both together so you know I'm not just showing one and saying it's two. Two rolls of toilet paper. We got two sets of garbage bags totaling nine each, so 18 total. Two bars of soap. Package of toothpaste. And then several bags of laundry detergent. I think there's four or five, maybe six in here. So that's in addition to all the foods and things that I showed in the last part. So thank you again, Perita.